Hi, I'm Aaron Merch from 2H Media. In this video, we're going to walk through some basic troubleshooting to solve 90% of the problems you might encounter in Oxygen Page Builder. Now before we get started, you'll want to back up your WordPress website. The process to do so depends on your web host, so check with your host to find out what instructions they give for creating a backup. In our case, we're hosting through Cloudways, so all of our backups are created automatically. Starting from the WordPress dashboard, hover over Settings in the left-hand navigation and select Permalinks. Now, this next step might seem a little redundant, but what we're going to do on this page is save our permalinks twice. So click the Save Changes button, wait for the page to reload, and then click the Save Changes button again. After saving your permalinks twice, hover over Oxygen in the left-hand navigation and select Settings. From the Oxygen Settings page, click the Security tab, and then click the Sign All Shortcodes button. Click the checkbox to confirm that you've backed up your site, and then select any number of post types. If you're not confident what the different post types are, I recommend selecting all of the checkboxes on this page. With your post types selected, click the Start Shortcode Signing button to re-sign all of your shortcodes. Oxygen will loop through your posts one by one and begin re-signing your shortcodes. This process might take some time to complete, so go make a cup of coffee and come back to this when it's done. Once Oxygen has finished re-signing your shortcodes, a completed message will appear in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. When you see the message, hover over Oxygen in the left-hand navigation and navigate back to the Oxygen Settings page. This time, click the CSS Cache tab, and then click the Regenerate CSS Cache button. Once again, Oxygen will begin completing this process in the background. Leave this page open and wait for your CSS Cache to finish being regenerated. At this point, the process changes a little bit depending on which additional caching plugins you're using. In our example, we're using the Breeze plugin, so we're going to hover over Breeze in the toolbar and select Purge All Cache. If you're not using the Breeze plugin, you might be using another common caching plugin, such as SiteGround Optimizer. In any case, navigate to your plugin settings page and look for an option to purge the cache. If you're using Cloudflare to speed up your website, there's one additional step that's easy to miss. You may need to navigate to the Cloudflare dashboard and click the Purge Cache link to purge your cache on Cloudflare as well. After clicking the Purge Cache link in Cloudflare, click the Purge Everything button to fully clear your Cloudflare cache. So there you have it. If you followed along with this entire video, you now know some basic troubleshooting steps to follow if anything goes wrong in Oxygen Page Builder.